بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أيها الأحباب continuing on in our series of good deeds for the day we've reached the fifth day and one of the good deeds that we could strive to do for this day and in fact we'll mention two deeds one is for the men especially to strive to pray in the masjid to strive to go in the masjid either for the fajr prayer or for the maghrib prayer strive your utmost and the reward is immense from Allah and for the women and this can be for the men or the women is to give a gift to your neighbor strive to do some small kindness al-ma'un something uh, a small kindness that will not be lost on the scale of good deeds al nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam qala من غدا إلى المسجد أو راح عد الله له في الجنة نزلا كلما غدا أو راح متفق عليه. In a hadith that was narrated by Abu Huraira رضي الله تعالى عنه, in which the Prophet صلى الله عليه وسلم said. He who goes to the masjid at dawn or dusk for the prayer, for the salat, Allah prepares a hospitable abode for him in Jannah. Every time when he walks to it or comes back from it. And this is collected in Bukhari and Muslim. So this shows us the importance of trying to pray in Salat al-Jama'ah. For some people, Allah has favored them to where they are regular people who pray their salats in the masjid, from amongst the men especially, because it's a, a duty upon, uh, upon the men to strive their utmost to do so. And Allah has favored some people with that blessing. But for those of us who are lax in this duty, strive to begin to implement that in your life. And that's your good deed for the day, bi'idnillah. And in another hadith, an Abi Huraira radiallahu ta'ala anhu qal, qala Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, ya nisa al-Muslimat. لا تحكرن جار لجارتها ولو فرسن شات متفق عليه أبو هريرة رضي الله تعالى عنه reported that the messenger of Allah صلى الله عليه وسلم said O Muslim women never belittle any gift you give your neighbor even if it was a hoof of a sheep so ayu al-ahbab, giving small kindnesses to the neighbor, whether it be sugar, whether it be salt, whether it be something that they, they require, something that they uh, might request from you, you'll receive reward for Allah subhanahu, from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala if you do it for his sake subhanahu. So strive this day to make salat in the masjid and give a gift to your neighbor and give uh, a gift to someone for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.